the latest information reaching TV3 uh, News is that the uh, executive director of Dankwa Institute, Nana Atobra Kweku, has been invited by the BNI over the three South African ex-police officers who were in the country a few weeks ago and were arrested, detained, and have been repatriated. Well, we do get Nana Atubra on the line. We'll pick his thoughts on uh, whether he has honored the invitation and what has transpired uh, in the last few hours. But that is the news we are getting, and uh, it's still an unfolding story. When we get details, we will bring it to your attention. But we are joined on the line by Nana Atubra Kweku, who is the executive director of the Dankwa Institute for some clarity on this and an update. Good afternoon, sir. Thank you very much for your time. Hello, Nana Tobra. Hello, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you now. Good afternoon. Thank you for joining us. Good afternoon and good afternoon to your listeners. Yes, uh, have you been to the BNI offices? And uh, if not, when are you likely to go there? Yes, I have been there. I was invited there, and so I made it yesterday. Yesterday, okay. Um, what were some of the issues that you discussed? And uh, we are told you were invited because of the three South Africans. Is, is that the case? Yeah, you're right. About the three South Africans that were arrested in the country and recently deported. It's about them that I was invited. Uh, one of them happened to have been invited by the DI. Uh, sometime in December for a program that he came in February and after that he left and so when they arrested the three and he was one of them I think they, they thought that we had something to do with it because um, his visa he came into the country with was acquired when we invited him but then we invited him to Ghana he came for a program for that he left okay um are you expected back there or uh, your uh, decision to honor that invitation brings finality to the issue, you think? I thought it should have, but it didn't. And so I was told to report today, this morning. I was there. And unfortunately, the office I'm supposed to be reporting to have gone to court. And so I didn't see him. Okay. Have you been given another date to reappear? No, I've not been given another date. I didn't see the, re the office I was supposed to. So maybe I'll check on him again and know when next I'm supposed to be there. All right. Do you think that there is a correlation whatsoever between your invitation of one of the three gentlemen and the recent uh, quote-unquote ransacking of the Dankwa Institute offices? Uh, well, well, judging from the invitation, it would seem that that is the link the guy is trying to draw. But it's for me to also explain to them and for the records, to also vindicate us that we invited him once he came and he left. And if he was found in this country again, um, it wasn't at our invite. And it can happen to anybody. You could be invited to the U.S. or the U.K., anywhere for that matter. You get a five-year visa. You go for your program and you finish. But mm -hmm. since you have the visa and somebody else invites you for that, you can always go back on that visa. And so I don't think it's anything strange at all. And uh, finally, have you been shaking in any way by this uh, back and forth with the BNI and this particular invitation? Oh, not at all, not at all. I'm, I'm, I'm okay. I'm, I'm more worried about the image the BNI seems to be creating for itself. And I think it's needless. And mm -hmm. so efforts should rather be going into what can be done to redeem the image because it's being seen and it's growing in that direction that it's become more of a political tool which may not necessarily be the case but then it keeps doing things that lends itself to be to, be, to begin to be seen as such and that worries me because then that wipes away the confidence of the public in that very important institution uh, because if the public whom you are seeking to serve and to protect feel like you act on a thing or the other based on the political coloration that you give to it then it becomes a source of worry Okay, we are grateful for your time this afternoon. Anna Atubra Koeku, he is the executive director of the Dankwa Institute, uh, confirming that he has been to the BNI offices upon invitation. And uh, it was because of the three South Africans who were in the country who are currently out of the premises or out of Ghana's jurisdiction. But uh, he's yet to go back there again or contact who, whichever officer he was supposed to meet there because he didn't see him today. And so when he does, uh, go back to the BNI and we do get that information. 
we will certainly let you know about it. This is still Midday Live on TV3. Let's